Baldwin oil filters versus Amsoil oil filters. Let the battle begin, starting off with Amsoil Super Duty oil filter. Now, let's go ahead and check out some of Amsoil's claims before we start the competition. Outperforms other oil filters. Capacity in grams. Check out these charts. I mean, they just blow the competition away. Wix is said to be one of the best engine oil filters, but they claim they're last. Terms of performance, hard to believe, but we'll have to check out the results. For cars, light trucks, and heavy duty trucks, the Amsoil filters are expected to perform in a variety of tasks. First, they must have the ability to flow in adequate volume of oil while keeping restriction to a minimum. Second, in order to provide an adequate service life, they must possess adequate particle storing capacity. Third, they must be efficient enough to remove contaminants of a given size and range. Now, unfortunately there, you just saw the Amsoil canister and it did have some bits of rust inside. I'm not really sure what's going on with that one. As for the bald one, looks pretty clean. No issues with this canister, or should I say housing. Now. Let's go ahead and take a look at the gaskets for each that seal it against your block from engine oil leaks. These are made of a natural rubber. This Amsoil filter does have a typical anti drainback valve made of natural rubber as well. Not the highest quality, but hey, it gets the job done. Now, let's look at the bald one. It uses a coil spring to hold everything nice and tight. You see it has like a white powder. This seems to be from the manufacturing process making these engine oil filters. I see it on a lot of filters. However, for the Amsoil, I'm not sure if these are just fibers or what's going on here. I've never really seen anything quite like it. I'm not sure it's a major issue or anything like that. You'll have to decide for yourself. Now the Amsoil graph that was shown shows the filtration capacity of the same nine full flow oil filters using SAE test method HS806. Test results indicate the Amsoil SDF14 offers a contaminant holding capacity up to 185% greater than competing oil filters. Which is nice to know, but check this out. Not really a strong filter for the Amsoil. It's said to be made of a synthetic cellulose medium. However, for this one, the Baldwin oil filter media, well guys, it appears to be made of just a plain cellulose media. Both oil filters claim to provide up to 10,000 miles of protection. I will say again, this is more of a paper style uh, filter for the Baldwin. They have advanced the uh, Amsoil filter somewhat more. The cellulose synthetic and glass blend media from Amsoil to provide longer life and improved efficiency. You can see the evenly pleating of both filters. I don't see any really poor designs. I don't see glue everywhere all over the filter media which can be a problem in the long run. You can check out these base plates seem to be made of Heavy, hardy steel don't seem to be a big problem, except for the back here. Now, when it comes to this Baldwin filter, why are they using cardboard on the inside of the filter? I'm not really too happy with this one, guys. They need to do something about this. I've seen typical natural rubber used in this situation, and that's probably what they should have used. Guys, if you would tell me what you would like to see next, I really would appreciate your kindness. Thanks for watching. Nate's Interactive Auto.